I'm Lassa Del Garza. I'm 15 years old and I will be a junior at Sherilyn High School here in Mission, Texas. I'm the middle child of three and I'm proud to say that I'm part of an anti-tobacco organization here in the Valley. I care about tobacco prevention because in a personal level my grandpa died from lung cancer and both my grandpa and my grandma started smoking when they were 15, which is around my age, which is my age. And the funny thing is that people back then, they didn't know about it. They were encouraged to smoke by magazines, media, society. And it was seen as a stress reliever and other ways to, to hang out and socialize. But nowadays, people know about it. And there are campaigns like the one I'm part of right now, which inform people of the negative effects and all the harmful a ways that it impacts your life, not just you, but the people around you. And people still smoke, which is what worries me, especially now with the new e-cigarettes coming out, having everyone think that they're cool and that they're a new product and a new way to socialize. It's really worrisome, and I really care about helping people stay away from them, especially since you don't really know what's in them at this point since they're not FDA approved. What makes me a good leader? I like listening to people, I try to understand their feelings, and I look forward to helping them. I also work very hard on anything I commit to, and I am disciplined, honest, and responsible. I am also very passionate about community service. I feel it's a win-win situation where I get to hang out with my friends and have fun while improving the community. For example, we worked with Leo Club where we got to work on pet projects, beautifications, and nursing home facilities. If you give me the opportunity to be the voice for the Youth Tobacco Prevention Coalition in Texas, I promise to work very hard towards our goals. We want to create as much awareness as we can against the damages tobacco causes not only to the people who smoke, but to those around them as well. There will be many people who will take a cigarette in their hand for the first time and we want to be able to influence them to make the right decisions.